What you should not do on social media as a job seeker? With so many things happening around on the internet, it becomes really tough and challenging for a job seeker to understand what to do and what not to do. Firstly, can you tell me why is it so important for a job seeker to be available on social media? As a job seeker, you know, finding a right opportunity or a right employment is extremely difficult. You might be spending countless number of hours hopping from one interview to other interview, sending out resumes, filling out applications. How many people are really getting through this? Hence, a study says, use of social media when finding a right job or a right opportunity has been increasing over a decade. You might feel surprised to hear that 80% of the employees use social media when conducting a job search and 85% of the employers use social media to hire the right talent. Whether you are a fresh graduate looking for a breakthrough or a seasoned working professional looking for new opportunities, social media has become an essential platform to get through this. And the best part is it doesn't cost you anything, isn't it? Although it is true that the traditional methods of finding the job still, still works. And it is also true that social media has revolutionized the way how employees look for the jobs and employers find the right talent. A study says 75% of the employers are likely to look through your social media profiles to find a potential employer before they hire them. Employers would like to understand more about you, what kind of person you are, what kind of interest you have, how, how well are you suitable for this position, how well are you able to work with the team. They look at your social media profiles to understand how you are presenting yourself. Most of the employers takes the hiring decision whether to hire you or not based on how you are presenting yourself on, on social media. So let's, let's look at some of the things which you should not do on social media as a job seeker. Number one, don't keep the junk on your social media profiles. Make sure you remove all the junk and have your social media profiles polished and professional which helps you to get noticed. How about creating a social media profile with a professional looking picture, a good banner detailed professional summary explaining your uh, explaining your employment and having a lot of connections that increases the chance of you getting hired how about having a having a video created an introduction video created and attached to your media pro, uh, attached to your profile describing why you number 2 don't just scroll through all the posts throughout the day. Being active on social media doesn't mean that you have to go through all the posts created by others. Don't just be a consumer of the content. Become a producer as well. Instead of going through all the posts, how about giving your opinion in the comment section in two lines. First line, tell what did you like about that post. Second line, what is your opinion on that particular subject? Number three, don't comment interested in the job 
रिक्वायरमेंट कमेंट सेक्शन जस्ट बाय कमेंटिंग इंटरेस्टेड अंडर द जॉब डिस्क्रिप्शन विल नॉट हेल्प यू टू गेट अ जॉब or sending out personal messages asking for a job will not help you either tell me why a person would be interested in your profile and interested in your request instead of just commenting interested how about sharing in the comments why you are suitable for that position write few words why you are suitable In a small write-up, how different is this? Number four. Don't just create a post asking for asking for a help to get a job. Instead of that, how about creating a video introducing yourself and and demonstrating your skills. will that not help you to stand out of the others and get you noticed isn't it yes it is i know you might be still thinking how doing all this will help me in getting a right job will recruiters have will recruiters go through all my social media profiles all the content that i have created do they really have time to go to each and every social media profile of a candidate and all of their posts do they really do that definitely not we are in a digital world my friends it's an artificial intelligence and machine learning world there are so many such tools available in the market which can integrate to all the social media platforms and read through all the content your profile and provide a crisp and precise overview about who you are what kind of interest you have what kind of person you are which helps the employers to take the right decision isn't it interesting see at first it might look scary you might feel hesitant hesitant to jump but try to embrace there are so many ways to get started without feeling overwhelmed or or over the head social media is is an extremely powerful platform to show to showcase who you are to get you out there in the market use it effectively and efficiently to get your future employer all the very best for your social media journey feel free to reach out to me in case you are looking for help on career growth and to learn sap sales and distribution i'm happy to help you thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe that will encourage me to create more videos that helps you to grow in your career thank you once again for watching this is aman signing off Take care bye bye